Hi, dear students. Now we are going to revise geometry. This is the second lesson, the second revision lesson. Revision 2. Properties of triangle congruence. Two triangles are congruent if one of the following cases is satisfied. We are going to state cases of congruence of two triangles. S, S, S means side, side, side. All three corresponding sides are equal in length. If we have two triangles like, like, like what's shown here, triangle ABC, triangle DEF, two triangles, these two triangles are congruent, when the three sides, the three corresponding sides are equal. What's the meaning of corresponding sides? Here in the first triangle, which is colored with blue, AC, the corresponding side in the other pink triangle is DF. The corresponding side AB is DE. And the last one, the, tri the last side, BC, the corresponding side to it in the other triangle is EF. So, the three corresponding sides are equal in length, then or therefore triangle ABC is congruent to the triangle DEF. The second case... SAS side angle side A pair of corresponding sides and the included angle are equal Here we have AC in the blue triangle equals to DF in the other triangle and AB equals to DE and the included angle between them, which is between these two sides. The angle A included between AC and AB. For the other triangle, angle D included between DF and DE. So if we have here two sides, two corresponding sides are equal and the included angle between them, between them is equal, Therefore, these two triangles, A, B, C, D, E, F, are congruent. The third case here, A, S, A, angle, side, angle. A pair of corresponding angles and the included sides are equal. Here we have two angles which are angle A, equals to angle D, the corresponding angle to it in the other triangle is D, angle B and the corresponding one to it in the other triangle is E, they are equal, and the included side, which is AB in the first triangle, equals to DE in the second triangle, also the side is equal. This case is called angle side angle therefore triangle abc is congruent to the triangle def this case is rhs this means that right hypotenuse side of course this case is in the right angle triangle if we have two right triangles are congruent here ha, wh why these two triangles must be congruent what's the case in the right angle triangle if we have two right angle triangles the hypotenuse the right side the right side the side of the right angle and the hypotenuse and the other side are equal this means that these two triangles are congruent so, if we have two right triangles, these two right triangles are congruent if the hypotenuse and one leg are equal. Of course, the third case or the third 
item is its right angle. Here we have both angles are equal because angle B and the corresponding to it, which is angle E in the other triangle, are right angles. Therefore, here we have two, the hypotenuse and one leg are equal and the third is the angle. So, ang triangle A, B, C is congruent to the triangle D, E, F. Thank you very much for listening and good luck.